the Reyna pickup, which I think is always great. So let's take a look at the agent composition. Oh, but before oh. that, though, Penguin will be able to take that pool one tap with we, some good shots. Yeah, we cut away just for just in the nick of time to uh, miss that kill, unfortunately. But very surprising that he was able to control the spray from the Frenzy to actually get that. I mean, going down long with a Ghost versus Frenzy seems like that should be a Ghost favorite matchup, but. Pardon me, got, got, got caught off guard there, looking for the ultimate orb, and now lurking on through, nicely done, gets the kill onto one, Fat Penguin is surprised, not sure where they're getting shot from, now the ghost recovered by Nugin, as he will lose the duel to Fidel, wow, but it's a two for one trade. Luckily enough, they weren't punished too hard on A long, they will be able to score into A side, very good stuff being shown from Morph, gets the plant for A long, if I'm not mistaken, so... Excuse me, uh, not for a long. So we do see that uh, coming in from the other side. Oh, of, oh, we do see a big push coming in from Myth here. The Thai teams are showing up indeed. As teams from Indonesia are now showing their fiestas. We do see, uh, we do hear a bit of a diffuse, but a very <laughs> aggressive push. Yeah, nice job there, just using strength and numbers. That's as you can tend to do here. As we'll be splitting the, the ultimate orb there for our spin. Goes for the Molly onto the side. Has to be very careful. Caught yeah, yeah, is good. Ooh, Fidel, wow, gets it onto Patipan. Yep. Patipan now going down as they begin to trade over in the garage. That's going to be a Marshall already up, as you said, on Poo One Tap. He's not able to find anyone actually lurking through. Oh, but a great spray out from two there. Mush two room, more like mush two kills as he's able to get two there with the Spectre now rotating around the box. He's doing a little bit of ringer on the Rosie. Oh, a good trade from Fidel. Wow, at least able to get here quite a bit, actually. I think they're going to have uh, themselves a fantastic time on defense. They got so many ways to actually slow down all these pushes as pushing now through mid famous. is able to get the pick and with the Vandal, he's going to know that uh, something's up here. Nice job getting the overheal off the Leer just to be able to cover a peek as well, standing nearby the uh, double doors is the Love family who's got uh, some love to share from that Bucky for uh, anyone that walks on through there. Of course, it's a very close quarters kind of love there. Uh, hopefully, members of Morph are not going to be pushing through double doors. We do see a bit of an aggressive move here, trying to get someone into the smoke, trying to see whether or not there could be a Bucky shot onto any members of Morph. No However, we do see there is going to be a one-man disadvantage. Wow. There goes the Hunter straight from Videl Wow, trying to get as much uh, room as he can. Mushroom will go down. Yeah. And Poo one tap gets a shot onto Freya. Very nicely done. Indeed, nicely done. New Gen now spraying through the smoke with the Bulldog, but Morph trying to close off this side and secure the plant left. uh very surprising left. third round already having the ultimate orb that is some impressive efficiency there uh for the side of more because they're able to get the pickoff and then that just opens up the site here myth with like a half buy here might just try and go for the defuse so that's not a good start as cut already finding the kill on the poop one tap all right, new, jo uh, new gen, excuse me, coming up from top side wow. here, not going to be enough, will be taken down, does quite a bit of damage against members of Morph here, very, very dangerous indeed for uh, the Love family, he does not have enough range to actually contest this, oh, but I speak very wrong, like I eat my own words as Fidel, yeah. wow, will be taken down for the count, very nicely done from a myth, as we do see two members still alive for Morph, it is going to blow as it is going to reach into round number. Number four. How many members were there? He only spotted the cipher out. Yeah. Spike is towards C, so they have to be a little bit wary on wow. how they want to push it out. Fidel Wow will be able to take down a love family with a trap tap to the wall, excuse me. As we do see coming out through double doors is gonna be morph. They decide to bug out from double doors, not gonna go into C from garage, considering there is gonna be a two-man uh, crossfire, almost a three-man crossfire here uh, from the side of myth. Uh, they but are going to be forced to commit to a site here eventually, though. As you can see, them not smoking off the B connector towards C. We still have plenty of people in the site, though. Left. Myth have reacted quite appropriately to this one. And Morph, oh, it's going to be a bit of a risky push in now. Is here we go. It's about to kick off. All right, so we're going to be seeing how... Oh my goodness gracious me, we do see Patipan will be able to get the trade off, but Cut will return the favor. Mushroom gets Cut as well. Famous gets one, and Fidel Wow gets one for himself as well. Doesn't look good for Myth as they will be able to tie up. Pull one tap decides he's going to get out of there. 
saves up whatever he can and lives to fight another day. Yeah, I'm surprised that went so poorly for Myth. I think Morph just kind of waiting them out, kind of baiting them into the game. Maybe they're not actually going for the sites, but definitely should have been more prepared for some action there. They, they definitely and tried to make them commit, so Myth so commit on to see. However, looking at what's... Oh, but wait a minute. We did see a bit of an exchange there. Myth comes yeah. up and decides to run it back. Tries to get oh, a little bit of information, no. but Famous will be able to get the shot off on to Patipan. Not a very good start for Myth here as we head into round number five. Some good exchanges here. Jet decides to tailwind out of there. Yeah, the knives uh, miss actually. That was her using the ultimate if I'm not mistaken. So that's two ultis used by Myth here and nothing gained in exchange. I think Morph are going to be playing this very aggressively now. Uh, they could be in a bit of trouble. Then again, you have a very, very defensive lineup here for Myth. I think that's why Morph is actually taking it so slowly, because they can delay, I don't want to say indefinitely, but for some time, as they're now going to try to hit him with the Hunter's Fury. This time out from Mushroom, he gets the kill onto Cub, nearly gets a second one trying to predict it, but now they're going to equalize here for a piece in this round. All right, there goes the shock dart in uh, to mid double doors. Does opening up a little bit of room for garage, but they have to be a little bit wary on how they want to be approaching this. Why? Because it is going to be a slight little re rotate left. onto A. Yeah. 30 seconds left. Good this read. coming on to heaven. Really good read by Myth. He does. He backs out of the site knowing that the push is coming. Instead, he's going to wait for reinforcements. Looking for the pick. No, it's Freya actually through the wall. Who's going to find the head of Nugent up into heaven? Is it going to be the Omen? but it's going to be a 4v3. Good positioning here from Myth. It's going to be a little bit of a hard retake for them. It is going to be very hard for Myth to retake, especially considering that they do not have the numbers. Morph is pretty much a hit, despite the fact that uh, Famous is pretty low in terms of HP. They're going to try to get as much. Oh, but Famous shows that yeah. the amount of HP doesn't matter. We'll be able to get at least 3 and 4. Stiff. But we do see... Left. A bit of an interesting turn here yeah. on to C. Oh, whoops, cut just right into the wall. Uh, yeah, there's the Empress, so Morph now looking for these entries. But yeah, it's kind of weird. I feel like the the, the Myth Draft actually kind of counters this Morph at all, almost all stages of the game. As Fat Penguin good in the entry frag now into C site. He hears someone left. there, but uh, he's going to be able to spray them down just as easily. The Empress still not finding anything here. As Cut instead out from Garage finds two more, and it's going to be Myth once again with just the Cypher versus the world. But he does have this Bucky. Five shots, five enemies. He might have this here, Hound. I really like this. This could be a flawless <laughs> round coming uh, from Morph. What happened really well was the fact that they decided to push on to see Long. <laughs> Long live the Empress! <laughs> Long live the Cypher! It's actually happening! Now he's going to change to the van, but what a coward. Now, of course, Puan tapped up. He's going to be getting gone on. They were rotating around to try and cut him off. And uh, trouble with this double operator strap. But it depends on what opening pickoffs we can get. Myth as well, just so patiently. Finally, they're going to show each other, but it's going to be Puan tap doing just that. He you're on to Fidel Wow. Fidel Wow, that is. Uh, Fidel Wow. A little bit too haphazard with the way oh. he was speaking, but we do see more than one member here. Cut will be able to get the trade onto Poo one tap, and A Long is going to be open. Very good smokes here coming in from members of Morph. They do left. go for the site on A, and this could be oh, where it turns away. over the head for Myth, as Myth yeah. right now has to get back in to the tempo to get for the retake. I think that's a little bit too greedy there from the Cypher going for the Operator kill. He saw on the cameras at least two walking through that smoke, the Cypher and the Jet. It's safe to assume that with Cypher and Jet both there, that the rest of the team is behind him there. Uh, I think he should have just dropped back uh, and, and played it safe, because worst case scenario, the Jet can kind of just rush at you when it's so hard to hit a Jet, even if you're the best flicker in the world. But now, it's going to be up to the rest of Myth to try and, and, and retake this site. It's A yet again, and a really strong setup here for Morph. All right, Morph right now with four angles being covered with four members. We do see Myth right now looking towards getting in the drop from Heaven. Very reckless indeed. Very good stuff being shown from Patipan, but it's not going to be enough as Cut will be able to take down three and four and ends the round with the love Myth, excuse me, with uh, their guard down in whatever juncture that they can get. Man, Morph is just taking this so slowly. They're inching all over the map. It looks like they're going to decide for C. There is an enemy there. Much to room. Oh, no. He's got only a bow out. Unable to land the initial sheriff shot there for a kill. They do have the ultimate now. Fidel Wow is looking for a kill. He will get one now, as that's already two members murdered on the C site. And there's going to be the third.
Very, very interesting to see how these temple, wow. these temple rushes are being held from members of Morph. They are pushing it towards members uh, of a Myth as oh. Myth right now. Oh, Myth trying their best with new gen to take down more than two. Uh, so it was really just a, a really strong push out from Myth. I, I kind of. Unfortunately, he, he put himself into a corner, got scouted, and he gets picked off through the smoke. He needed to be a little bit faster on the smoke if he was wanted to try and live there, but always risk the Phoenix. There we go, left. into sight. They go. They will be able to get the scout on the one, and that's Nugent. And down goes Cud, getting caught there by the trap. Oh, the second op shot from Hell will not connect out from Nugent, though. And the other will the shot bolt, actually. It's going to get blocked, but Fat Penguin now from A short is able to at least get the kill on the Nugent. The retake, though, is pretty good. The Love family is trying to make this a 4v2. Spike needs to get blocked. Planted in the process now as more fat penguin grabs too that will allow the spike to go down here hound well we do see fidel wow does try to defend but it's going to be numbers against him here as it is going to be a mush tomb as well as uh, the love family holding window here to garage he's got two members in that smoke let's see if he's going to hold the angle as he begins to fire decent damage being done he's going to go for the reload the peaks coming on through and he Oof. will pay quite heavily for that one cut right now being able to take down the love family we do see there is going to be four all three ultimate abilities available for the side of myth only two for the side of morph very interesting to note that we do see there is going to be a bit of uh Split here, a 1-1-2 one, one, formation for the side of Myth, whereas members of Morph, and I think they are having a little bit of... Ooh, oh wow, look at that ultimate, but it's not going to be enough here, Famous will be able to get much too. Teleports wow. across the map with Spike that planted. ultimate from Morph, very, very nicely done. Yeah, so so that's something that I've been noticing a lot of these SEA teams do. I think every team does, but I'm just noticing now that I'm watching a lot more Valorant, is they like to bait with a bunch of the sound cues. Frequently, we'll see one man lurk, or usually the lurker get really aggressive against kind of a common peak angle. Uh, he'll he'll then go into cover and start running in the cover, only to have someone else actually walk in and just stand in the middle and, and destroy the peak here once they know, once they think, rather, they can take that advantage. That was actually a very similar play there. The Omen ulting, trying to bait someone out, immediately does. The Reyna is able to just swing wide and just headshot him as he's completely distracted, and that next them the round. Very, very good stuff there. Good usage of the Omen ulti. Yeah, it was a very good usage indeed, and they were able to cover a lot of ground and it's an eco round. But I think they need to be taking it a little bit easier now, as that's going to be one free kill. Look at that guy! I didn't even notice. As that's going to be Nugent onto Cud. I think everyone else a little bit too distracted by the Hunter's Fury raining on. And great damage there by Patrick Venice. Nugent looking for one more. The knives eventually will connect. He missed four, but lands the all important crucial last knife. Two kills already by Nugent. He's looking for more as well, trying to wall and picking up a weapon now escaping out of the window he's got a friendly oh, omen as they're gonna go continue to chase him giving Nugent the 3k hound that I that is what I was saying about myth here last final member for the side of morph is going to be famous famous right now is going to oh, oh. whiffs it and it's going to be punished yeah. by famous Nugent had a bit of a streak there will be taken down for the count and we do see that a lot of this was basically oh, because a myth oh but wait famous there being able to take out three <laughs> trying to clutch it out it's got to be careful but there no it's not gonna be enough a poo one tap this has actually scouted nobody at sea he might be getting baited here but they're still holding on a garage yeah i'm very surprised they didn't react to that information i think this is just more throwing them for a loop now getting inside their mind i normally i feel like a team sees that gets that intel absolutely nobody in c lobby you know that there's an operator mid and you go all right they're probably going to be going left. a or b then and now they're going to be going for this retake they actually have got a good start here catching them before the team is fully in Trenched here. There's going to be an easy 2k now before Cut strikes back. Very nicely done from Cut there. Oh, but you see that UJ will be able to take the Freya. You see them morph right now, not having enough. But wow, oh, wow look at that Cut cleaning house with three members of Myth down for the count. Yeah, it's down to the 1v1 here. Omen versus the Jets. And we do actually have that updraft and another tailwind here. The Love family. Maybe gonna try and bait this with the three knives. Oh, is he just gonna stick it here into the smoke? Now goes the Jet, who will be able to get that fourth kill and secure the last round of the half. At the switch, it's gonna be more up on with the 
Ghost, he hears plenty of reloads. He knows there's at least one here. But the flash might be good enough, at least forcing Cut to use plenty of utility now. The push coming from C in the meantime as well. Very nicely. Nice push coming from a Myth. Decides to go on to C long. Immediately drops down a lot of utilities on the C side. We do see oh, more. Wow. Whoa! Cut was able to take down one Freya as well. But Patibun and Mushroom decide to reply as well. Famous here from the side. Gonna go oh. for a bit of a ring around the Rosies as Famous has been taken down by Patibun. Fat Penguin will take down Pooh one time. And it's gonna be a one against two situation. Fat are very brave <laughs> to fight it out. Oh, look at oh, that. Oh, it's like, yeah, they're all here. And they're like, yeah. literally, and they're like, yep, they're all here. And that's, you do not want to be fighting into this position. New Gen, though, going down is a pretty big kill for them. But SMG's uphill battles, I mean, this is not really looking in their favor. Palatan there, thinking, what, who wants that? Being a good soldier, just holding down his line. He goes, yeah, don't worry, guys. I got to that round. To spray someone down, uh, if they're taking an ultimate orb, sometimes it's better to just let them take it and let them think that there's no one else in the site there. Now, Myth, they know there's at least one here, and it's a rifle, as they will now get the location of that penguin. He's going to be holding this angle, and it's, whoa, a little bit of a, you know, a, a longer one trade there, but eventually the duel will by more as they're going to give it the flawless after all. Wow. Imp yeah, and it seems that um, from members of Myth, they do want to be giving oh, a lot. Oh, strange. but Fat Penguin that takes out Pooh one time, very unfortunate indeed, decides to go for the dark step into a long just to make sure that he doesn't get punished too hard. And I do like the fact that members of Myth decided to bug out of Garage and decided to go away from uh, trying to go to C. But coming in from C long though, three members from the side of Morph, mm -hmm. they are practically reading into it. Mid is still very much open, yeah. but we do see that there is going to be someone from B to C link, so that's not going to be an issue. But back. Indeed, let's see what they can get done. Hunter's Fury as well. They need to finish off this jet. They're not going to be able to do so. Morph just picking them off all the way down long. 1v3 scenario, and they are going to be able to gank them. No one has scouted mid. No one has scouted C. They've got the site for Cam as well, so he doesn't need to peek it. But on other rotation, they might be looking to just push through mid. The dark cover there. Everyone's lurking. I've never seen a game this slow. It feels like everyone is walking immediately from when the gates go down until the first shot is fired with new gen he's got the knives out there's gonna be the flash right into b are they gonna plant here is the question as the knives will not get the kill instead it's the headshot from the sheriff of the phoenix i do like uh, this uh, blaze wall here trying to get denial of uh, sight, line of sight from the side of Morph, making it a lot harder for them to retake. Mm -hmm. But amount of sight oh, here coming. Oh, nice. the trap yeah, gets cut in his feet. This is a really good hold. Actually, oh, nearly actually getting the spray. He is going to get the spray through the smoke with the Sheriff. I've said before, that's not really a gun you spray with, but they're proving me wrong already. The Prutong, the two pronged attack here out from Morph is falling apart at the seams as they will not be able to scout one. He's going to be able to get half the defuse, but immediately murdered and that's for some a very good hunter's fury here coming in from fidel while will not be able to take down anyone but cut will be able to open up oh. been very nicely done here as they try to go into double doors for a new gen oh new gen wow. tries but gets traded yeah that's a bit unfortunate nice hunter's fury there checks for anyone in a checks for anyone in window uh so either they're going long which is very unlikely because you must have heard their footsteps or they're going to be in c they predict that one very very nicely out from morth playing with the intel that they're gaining from the sova ultimate it's not just the Owl Drone that gives you information, it's it's the ulti as well. If you can line up your shots there, you end up getting a lot of information. Mushroom, then he's going to be now left to lurk through the garage. They have a Cypher as well, but 2v4 scenario. It's a little bit early to call for a save. I think they're just going to play this one really, really slow, as is no surprise, to be honest, this map, and see if they can get any additional pickoffs. Perhaps even get the spike down in order to get a little bit of the eco back in their control. Okay, so looking at Myth, uh, numbers are not in their favor. Four members for the side of Morph. We do see that both these teams are going to be completed in terms of complete in terms of their loadouts, but definite immediate definite advantage for the side of Morph. More members in Freya right now getting a lot of information here, but no clear cut. Does spot one going on to C long as well and oh. going towards C link? That's going to be interesting to see how that's going to be transpiring. Not going to be enough as Fidel Wow will be able to get it. Fidel Wow gets the double and it's going to be an easy defuse for the side of Morph as we head into the completion of round 18 and round 19 will be coming up next. 
Yeah, uh, well, game. They recognize that they can't really play uh, too aggressively here on this jet, especially on defense, because there's nothing really to back her up, right? On the one teams, maybe you got a breach, maybe you got a, a brimstone or something, as I'll hold that thought. Cud, again, just continuing to pop off. He's going to use his utility defensively here if needed to get back towards the team and play for the retake. Now, Famous is going to be rotating on over as Nugent able to get the pick onto one, but there goes Reyna as well as Sage. Set up the crossfire over to B, just setting up the killing zone. They hear them now going into C. They're not going to peek him from Garage, and it's going to be another plant, but Probably not another win here as more still have the Long advantage 4v2. Remaining. Even the Reyna is able to stay alive, dodging out the sheriff shop, going in vulnerable mushroom. Gonna get only one more before he's taken out. We're able to work with whatever lim limited resources that they had. Oh, good pick off there by the Love family, baiting out the Reyna. They know that she likes to play aggressively, but there goes Poo one tap. So another very vulnerable here to so any rotations, any lurkers here, Mythar. Uh, is something else that, that I really enjoyed seeing there was the fact that they killed the Cypher means that there's almost nothing to slow down this push. They go immediately proceed into the site. They got plenty of intel. They know that no one is holding the, the elbow or the connector. They're coming from Defender Spawn, so it's pretty much a free site for them. They don't have two smoke screens to work with. Jets, I believe, already used one early in the round, and, well, that was basically it. Morph, of course, they're not too hard-pressed here. They're going to be playing this one incredibly defensive. Now, four to four. Defenders, of course, always with a natural advantage here. Here on Haven, a little bit more nullified just yeah, due to the layout of the map. But now Cud is actually rotating on over to the A site as Freya will be scouted up in Heaven. They're going to come make the call and make the rotations over to A as the spike will be planted by Mint. Oh no, actually, they're going to force him to back off here a little bit. Hunter's Fury is going to completely whiff all three shots, but it will at least delay the spike plant. They don't really have enough time to rotate over to another uh, site here, Hound. Well, good um, idea. Oh, wait, though, new gen may actually get in the face of Morph, but it's got to be very wary on how that's going to be wow. working out for him. Very interesting uh, choice oh, to actually go for. Oh, he's going to get one, but that might be enough here for the myth. It's a 1v2. They just need to delay the diffuse here. He doesn't even need to live as that's going to be the omen. He, I believe, teleported? Where, where did he go? I think he teleported, actually. Unfortunately, we didn't manage to catch it. 